So the day has come, um, and today I'm going to be making chicken. Biryani. <laughs> I just wanted to do that. Uh, so we've got Sanjeev Kapoor here in the house and he's going to help me make a fine chicken biryani. I went through a lot of recipes and his one was probably the most sort of easiest to follow. Um, it, was, it looked simple, so I don't know. Um, so yeah, fingers crossed. I mean, what could go wrong? So guys, I'm in the process of marinating the chicken and so far, so good. I think it looks very similar to his one, but... I've just noticed he added an extra step where he put this fancy onions in there. I don't really, he didn't really show me how to make them. I don't know whether those onions are fried and then deep fried again. They've just gone completely brown colour. I mean, I could Google it and find out how to do it, but I think I might just leave that step out. Um, so I'm just going to get tuck in and really use my hands to marinate this. तो ये चिकन की मसाज हो चुकी है अब मैं क्या करूंगा ज्यादा देर के लिए नहीं बस 10 से 15 मिनट के लिए मैं इसे बाहरी काउंटर के ऊपर छोड़ देता हूं ये अच्छे से मैरिनेट हो जाएगा तब तक मैं आता हूं अपने नेक्स्ट स्टेप के ऊपर वो है चावल तो यहां पे मैंने बासमती चावल आल्सो ही टॉक्स अबाउट दिस स्पेशल चिकन मसाला रेसिपी दैट ही मेड फ्रॉम स्क्रैच सो आई एक्चुअली बॉट माइन दिस इज व्हाट आई गॉट इट्स क्वाइट कूल एक्चुअली यू गेट ऑल सॉर्ट्स ऑफ मसाला बॉक्सेस और सम चिकन मसाला देयर वाज Mutton biryani masala. There was fish biryani masala. All oh, quite cool actually. So yeah, that will come in handy for making my chicken curry next, if I don't forget. So according to Sanjeev, in order to boil your rice properly, he first adds in the water, um, and then adds in the spice. So he puts cinnamon, bay leaves, and um, those cardamom pods. So you let that boil in, and then you add in the rice. So what I did, I let the rice soak for about a couple of hours actually. I think there might be too much rice. I think I might have to play it by ear. In the rice, I didn't put the whole thing in because it was just way too much rice. Um, but he's, according to him, he's saying to cook the rice for about 70% or 80% because the rest of the rice gets cooked in with the chicken. So, yeah. So I think I 100% cooked the rice, not 70%. It looks really done. But you know what? It smells so lush. I can't expect, I can smell the cinnamon, I can smell the cardamom coming out of the rice. It smells really, really good. So yeah, I might cook like this from going forward. And for the next step is to add in the marinated chicken into the pan. Um, so what he does is he actually puts in ghee into the pan and then he adds in a little bit of oil as well. And I've never used ghee in my cooking, but it can't be that bad for you, can it? I'm pretty sure Shil Pachetti one time, she was promoting this, like calling it saturated butter and saying a little bit of ghee is actually really good for you. So, I don't know. What do you guys think? Right, so I clearly need a bigger pan. <laughs> um, I've chucked in all the marinated chicken into the pan, but look, it's just not big enough. And he's given me a top tip, which is to basically um, create a little hole in the middle, because apparently that the chicken doesn't stick to the bottom or something like that. His little trick. But there's no way I'm going to be able to do that. So I'm going to have to try and find a bigger pan. I'm going to put it on it. I'm going to put it on it. See, he puts that. Yeah, but if you would have told me how to make it, I would have put it in. See, I have no... You know what, I might... Put it fresh dhania. Without the onions, it's pretty much like half complete, the biryani. So you know what? I'm just going to fry up these sliced red onions that I found in the freezer, fry them up, and then add that to the top. Okay. Yeah. So I don't like saffron, so I've left this bit out completely. Yeah, yeah I didn't put this in. So he adds a little bit more ghee in it, but I fried my onions with ghee. So I'm not going to put it in, I think it's already ghee in there. Hmm. Actually, you know what, I might just put it in there just in case. Yeah, I think I've put enough salt in there already, I think I'm alright. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> Do you know what? He loves this masala, this chicken masala. He's, he's been raving about it since the beginning of the video. Right, let's put my um, shan masala in. 
तो मैक्सिमम फ्लेवर वाले मसाले होंगे तो बिरयानी भी मैक्सिमम फ्लेवर वाली ही बनेगी तो क्या करना है? Look, है। तो कुछ नहीं करना है जो करेगा ये वैसे अपने आप कर देगा मैं इसे ढक देता हूँ right, तो तो well. 25 मिनट से 30 मिनट God, you can take a bigger mouthful than that. It's not bad. It's not bad. No. Mm. Not bad. It's good. Let's see. Let's see what. What score should we give her? Eight point five, maybe. Ah! Five